attend 11th and 12th of April 2008. Università Bocconi is hosting Milan Moon Conference, a three-day simulation of the United Nations, organized by the Civico Liceo Manzoni of Milan. 300 international high school students from all over the world are going to turn into delegates of different countries following the protocols and procedures of real United Nations debates. This third edition held at Bocconi is about to get started. This year, the delegates of each country are going to debate economic and social issues, politics, human rights, environment and disarmament. Each delegate is called on to propose solutions to real problems and persuade the other countries. Let's see how students will come through this international experience. The first educational value I think is the responsibility for what is happening in the world, okay, so global issues are very important. The linguistic value is also very high for most of the students uh, who are not mother tongue English. Uh, another educational value, I think, is building team spirit and teamwork, which is important in the world of today. The workload for the students is quite heavy because they're not representing their own country and therefore they have to research profoundly on countries which perhaps they, they don't even know where they are in the world. So they have to research on internet uh, and they have to get in touch with consuls and embassies to find out what the foreign policy of these countries are. We are very pleased that to host this initiative here, not only for the contents and for the fact that it has many value added, but also because uh, we are, as a Università Bocconi, uh, fostering our internationalization very much. This is the kind of students we are looking for. Young, motivated, responsible, curious, open to global issues and uh, we hope that uh, a few of these uh, very brilliant students we have here in these two days will become Bocconi students in the future. We must remember that the United Nations system is formed by over 30 affiliated organizations and 191 countries that are working really hard to maintain balance and peace for the whole world. I'm the secretary general and that means like the head of everything but um, it's, I have the same duties as them because uh, we must chair the general assembly which is the biggest committee and uh, it is, we have a lot of responsibilities and it's quite scary but in the end we are doing it. I am the under secretary general of the Amuan Conf and I'm very glad to be because uh, I, with Amuan I really improved my English and my culture. Well, being a president of General Assembly is quite a privilege for many reasons because um, for example I get to chair in front of 350 people so it's um, both going to develop my eloquence and uh, but yeah m mostly meeting new people you know people are coming from all over the world. I'm from Paris for example so so I, I, I think that's a huge privilege that we get to meeting people all over the world and that we're going to keep that for a lifetime. It is my greatest pleasure to introduce to you all uh, Mr. David Bustamante, U.S. Council for Press and Culture. This model United Nations is really important for high school students. It, first of all, it gives them an idea how they're going to work in the world, but it also gives them an opportunity to understand the world in which we live and react to it. People who don't understand the world are acted upon. The ones who understand it, act. We were ECOSOC, Economic and Social Council, and we had a poverty reduction and um, uh, that was the issue that we discussed here in the General Assembly. But we also had a crisis, which was very interesting. We had this multinational company, and they came up with a solution in just one hour. 
It was amazing. What I really love is that the advisors from the other schools like really helped us a lot. They um, did it research and found a very interesting crisis so that we could do a better work than uh, we already tried to do and it was really perfect. It was really fun to explain them all and you know teach the procedures and share the knowledge and it's also a chance for us to uh, practice English because it's not our first language and MUN gives us a lot of opportunities to improve ourselves and help the others improve themselves too. So I liked it very much. Stand up, speak up, express their country's opinion. Don't be shy. Everyone is a student. You can't, the only mistake you can do is not standing up and not expressing your opinion.